Ishgard cannot well endure another assault. Even should her knights succeed in turning back the Horde, the casualties will be catastrophic. But what other choice do we have? It's not like we can talk it over with them. Dragons and men aren't exactly on speaking terms. With certain notable exceptions. You don't mean Iceheart? When last you spoke with her, she lamented her crimes, did she not? Then there remains a sliver of hope. If we can persuade Iceheart to act as our intermediary, we may yet be able to convince Nidhogg to abandon his bloody course. If there is to be a meeting, I would accompany you. Estinian? Even with your intermediary, Nidhogg's blood rage may render him deaf to reason. However, the mere attempt may afford our forces precious time to prepare. Of course, you might also consider a more direct approach to ending this conflict. With the power of the eye at my disposal, and the vaunted strength of the Warrior of Light, we could conceivably slay the beast outright. If we are to risk a face-to-face -face meeting with the Dread Worm, I, for one, would feel safer in the company of the Azure Dragoon. However, I should only turn to your lance if my words failed to find their mark. Is that clear? Perfectly. I shall assume that Isart enjoys similar diplomatic protection until instructed otherwise. A word of advice. Think carefully before divulging the particulars of this plan to Sir Emmerich. It would not do to have the Lord Commander accused of consorting with heretics. Indeed. I thank you for your counsel, Estinian. We shall be honored to have you with us. I am glad to be of service. <laughs>